Whoa, this has been a wild ride this week. Welcome to my house. I am Grumpy Buckboy and you're fishing with Uncle Buck here. And we are just finishing up the Weeping Willow missions. We had that disaster on the stomach bait, ground bait mission. Our buck got taught a lesson there, that's for sure. <clears throat> anyway, we're set up. We got our ground bait. We know what we're doing. We're gonna jump back over there and we're gonna grab this big guy. So, that being said, let's jump over there so I can show you the weapon of choice that we're gonna take with us. There we go. All right, we are taking the La Azadora N2. And see with a Torbalino 10,000 on it. We've got our open feeder, four and sixteen ounce. We've already got our mixed stomach ground bait up. And with that being said, we're going to jump over. We're going to go over to Arbor Lake over here, and we're going to jump in right there and see if we can grab this guy up. With that being said. Get your stuff, pack your cooler, make sure you got plenty of beer. This may be a long fight. I don't know. Never fought this one before, never caught it. So we'll see how it goes. We'll see you in a bit. New mission. A weeping low carp colossus monster. 99 catching the monster in a matter of time, patience, and of course the right tackle. Alright, this is where I went wrong the first time, fellas. I figured it's ground bait. I can just put this in a spar rod or my wrist rocket. Not a problem. I got I got carp rods with me. I had them. Well, the only way to hook this up is in a feeder. You gotta have either a bottom rod or a feeder pole. And that's what you gotta have. So the rewards we're gonna get for all this is they're fine and dandy. Let's say we're gonna just say okay here. Weeping will equip the stomach ground bait. Well, now what we gotta do, let's just, first off, let's get, let me get these poles out of the way and then we'll, and then I'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm headed over here to where we're gonna go after the Colossus Carp. And of course there was, Spawned in over here because we're let me get out of here. Fast. We're going over here to Arbor Lake, so I spawned in here and walked up and there was the pumpkin there, so I got some got some bait out of him. Uh, this one I got the noose. Yeah. Got a noose out of him. And then I hit two other pumpkins here. I got the hell frog. And then I also picked up while we're here the firefly larva. See? But now we're going to head over here and we're going after the Colossus. We're going to go right here to this spot and put that pole away, Buck. Let's go in here to the inventory. Let's get this pole. And we're going to put a feeder on him. Okay. Where's my feeder at? There is. Right there. Okay, now we've got a brown bait. Should be in here somewhere. Oh, there he is. Stomach ground bait. Let's go there. Alright, stomach ground bait. Mix, stomach ground bait. Mix. Now this is where I went wrong. I mixed this up prior. Yes, I know it's too light, but it won't be in a minute. Okay, so we're good there. Now we're mixed. We're ready to go. It says that it's too light, but now we need to change our hook size. So we're going to go over here to our hooks, and we're going after the biggest hook we've got in here. This one here. Go after Captain Hooks there, and then for bait, let's go. I hear tell. Forever tree seeds are the bait. Where are they at? Nope, they must be right up here somewhere. Up oh, there they are. It still says it's too light and the cast will be short. We'll see, we're equipped. Catch the monster. Two. 
Are we going to get out there far enough? I don't know. Oh, yes. We're planning out there far enough. Now, there's, this is a depositor. Let's take a look here, guys. This is why we're going here. All right. That's where we're thrown. Right out in that hole. So, it shouldn't take us too long. I think about right about that shadow because that's on the front edge of the hole. So, let's go right about there. We don't need a rod stand. I don't believe so. I don't think this is going to take too long. So, we're going to weigh her out. So if you go bang, and fish on, fight on. Well, that didn't take long at all. We're on. Got the La Casa Dova on here. This is a big, this is my big guy. Oh yeah. That's him. And we set pretty good on drag. We still got two more red bars above this, and he's tugging on right. So. We're not going to have any issues with this pole. <clears throat> yeah. This thing is even matched still. Whoa, easy there, Buck. I imagine he's going to go back and forth for a while. We're going to have a fight here. go back to get it. I mean, it only cost me another five days fishing, making that mistake. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, you can throw all you want now, buddy. You're not bothering me. This one's about over and I can get started on the Halloween stuff. Oh, okay, you want to come in a little bit? I'll take you coming in. Come on, big guy. Oh, yeah. Little quiver there. What's the matter, Buck? Got some weight to it. Good strong boy.
Come on, big boy. Boy, this would be a hell of a fight on one of them carp rods. <laughs> there again. I don't know I'm gonna squeeze that. I'm, I'm squeezing them. Nope, nope. Now this is one of the better fighting monster fish. The Pike Slasher was a was a hell of a fighter. Yeah, I can remember I caught him on a 25 pound, I think the 25 pound Arctic, and uh, that was a fight. Some of them just like the Leviathan, 221 pound. That was like catching a bluegill. Of course, I did it from my boats. Big difference. Come on. There we go. He took it out already. Not, not a final run. personal record he's only 120 pounder yeah I don't think I did very well on the leaderboard but that one he's kind of small well let's get a picture of him and we'll be right back okay fellas that's him we'll keep him 10,6200 XP get our plaque here yay 16 grand on that so 26,000 we made all together on that fish it's some good xp there very good xp claim that claim that for us all right new mission something wicked this way has come oh when halloween night can assignment full moon power really gets thin gate open between this one and this New mission to track. We get mistletoe branch for that. What is that going to be for Halloween? Mistletoe? That's Christmas. Kissing under the mistletoe. All right. I guess that's the mission we're tracking here. Okay. Something we could just travel to the Lone Star Lake. Well, unfortunately, we're not going there yet. We've got some money to make here. We've only got 237 pound here. Well, getting a big way here. Guys, that does it. We have completed everything here at Weeping Willow. We did the Exploration 1, Exploration 2, the Carp Mission. I did the Stomach Ground Bait Mission twice for you guys. <laughs> yeah, twice. Oh, well, this is, that's what happens when you make a rookie mistake there. I, You know, it's just one of them things I wasn't thinking I'm so used to leaving a, a lake, and yeah, 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 I know I'm, my ground bait's going. Because that's the thing that happens. If you've got her mixed, that's where I made my mistake. I mixed her up before I knew what gear I was going to put it on and make it work. So, and that's what cost me everything. It cost me six uni fish. I had to go back and get them all. But we did. We got them all. We know where we're at now, don't we? <laughs> all right, guys. I hope this helped you out a little bit with these missions. If it did, you know. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe. We got some more coming. Halloween's here. I got to go do some Halloween. But I'm going to go grab 
I got to get and finish this day up with maybe a good $70,000 a day. I still got some time to do that. So we're going to go and do that. I want to thank you for watching. Follow me on Facebook. Never ever give up the fight. You will prevail. All right, guys. We'll see you later. Listen to the critics, Sam.